Jeff Noné and his family operate this dairy farm just outside Edmonton. His farm ships 5,500 litres of milk a day. Here's an example of supply management, which is government-controlled dairy production. Last November, a fire engulfed one of his barns, killing more than 100 animals. Noné says because of supply management, he was able yeah, to rebuild good. confidently. That huge upfront investment is going to be able to be paid off over the long term because of the stability by this, uh, created by the system. He worries NAFTA talks could erase the protection Canadian farmers have. Here's why. Since the 1970s, dairy farmers have been under a system called supply management. Farmers have a quota, which means they only can produce a certain amount that meets the market. Under this system, farmers are protected from competition because the government blocks out foreign production through high tariffs. For example, Canada levies nearly 300% for butter and cream at 240% for cheese, whole milk and yogurt. With the North American Free Trade Agreement talks underway, Canada's dairy industry has become a big focus for Trump. The Trump administration has demanded Canada get rid of its tariffs on dairy to open up opportunities for American farmers. This week, the U.S. said they would not accept a modernized NAFTA agreement that did not include more American access to Canada's dairy market. While Canada has not budged on dairy, the threat of concessions is keeping some farmers on edge. Yeah. Create a lot of a lot of uh, heartache, and and it would probably be uh, something that for some farmers would would cause them to look seriously at their position in the industry. In Edmonton, Rochelle Sufi, City News.